Well, thank you very much, and hello, Duluth. Hello, Duluth. And a very special hello to Georgia. And I'm hearing our numbers are very, very good. There's a rumor. There's a rumor out there. We're doing well. Thank you very much. And I'm thrilled to be back in this incredible state with thousands of proud, hardworking American patriots, which is what you are. And I'd like to begin by asking a very simple question. Are you better off now than you were four years ago? That was very unanimous, wasn't it? Yeah. The answer is no. By any standard, the answer is no. And I'm here today with a message of hope for all Americans. With your vote in this election, I will end inflation. I will stop the invasion of criminals into our country. And I will bring back the American dream. I'm going to bring it back very quickly. Our country is being destroyed and tripled by Kamala Harris. A person that got no votes, no votes. Therefore, she's a threat to democracy. But together, we're going to fix our nation, and we're going to fix our nation fast. With your support on November 5th, America will be bigger, better, bolder, richer, safer, and stronger than ever before. This election is a choice between whether we will have four more years of incompetence, failure, and disaster, or whether we will begin the four greatest years in the history of our country. After all the catastrophes she has caused, Kamala Harris can't say one thing that you do differently. You saw that? What would you do differently? I can't think of anything. This is the worst president in the history of our country and the worst vice president in the history of our country. And wrong track just came out. 89% wrong track. I want to know who are the 11%? Who are they? Where are they? I'm asking you to be excited about the future of our country again. This will be America's new golden age. And remember, every problem facing us can be solved, but now the fate of our nation is in your hands. And Georgia, you have to stand up and you have to tell Kamala Harris, that Kamala, you've done a horrible job. You're the worst ever. There's never been anybody like you. You can't put two sentences together. The world is laughing at us because of you and Crooked Joe.